What's up, dweebs and beebs? In my hand today, I have I have some bolts. Um, those bolts go to a CSF radiator that we're gonna be installing in the bug eye here. Um, Ta-da! There it is. No, I just realized the person before me had a CSF replacement radiator in here. Um, with these O2s and these older models, the factory one, after a while or if it gets too hot, can split the plastic ends on them. Um, so people get replacements or they just upgrade. Um, today we are upgrading because this thing will be seeing track time. Um, so the, the first thing I had to do is cut these down. Um, these had a normal piece on there or a piece that came down here and they needed to be cut so they could fit here, such as example like that. Uh, I already got everything cleared out to throw this guy in. I uh, got new, it comes with new hardware, but I got new hoses for it. Okay, just got the fans on. Now it is time to throw it in the car. Okay. Here's the hoses. I went with blue. Uh, reason for doing blue is this car, when I got it four or five years ago, came with, I think these are, what are these? Mishimoto um, blue uh, piping already, or silicone tubing, whatever you want to call it. So that's the reason why I went with this. Uh, I would say if this stuff was brand new, it'd probably look like these bad boys. Uh, let me get one out. Here's the lower one. These are gimmick motorsports. Uh, they, they're champions, you know. Um, they're cheaper than like uh, the other competitors out there. The quality seems great so far that I've looked at uh, compared to some other ones I've seen. The old ones... I don't know. I'm sure these aren't the, the stock ones. I think these are like an AutoZone special, but uh, they they don't look bad. I'm gonna keep them as stocks, or not stocks, spares. This end was starting to rip a little or like chunk off, which I wasn't a fan about. Uh, I'm trying to decide if I wanna use these factory mounts for it or if I wanna go get new ones. Uh, I probably should get new ones. That'd be the safe bet. But gimmick motorsports, their part seam quality so far that I've seen. So, um, see this right here? That is a part of this guy. I'm no longer going to be using this as a spare. This was a test product. Now I needed to make one a little thicker. So, roll this up and I'll show you what it's to. So, under here, this is where the radiator mounts or sits. There's a rubber piece on this side. This side is for some reason missing one. Solution. Let's put it in the hole. Bloop. See, what's the difference? They're like the same thing. Ain't nobody worried about that. I hope they're about the same height. That might be a little screwed. I'll have to adjust that. So I just used the old radiator to test fit it. And it's definitely a little low, but it doesn't matter. That'll work perfectly. Uh, there's uh, the holders on top that'll push it down. So hopefully that squishes the rubber evenly. Um, This is pretty fun. Definitely not a struggle at all. Okay, where are the fun holes? 
Where are them goddamn hammers? Oh, shit. Okay. I came across an issue trying to throw it in. Uh, this fan right here, this piece, is smacking my aftermarket headers. They're telling me, um, they're smacking like right in like this spot where it's kind of missing. It's like smacking in here, which is very unfortunate. I just ran into another issue. Um, these headers, um, tell me, yeah, super nice. Um, they seem to have a clearance issue with every single thing. Ooh, that's that's dirt coming out of somewhere. Okay, just got done clearancing that. Um, I don't know what to say about that cut. That one. Barely needed trim, so I barely trimmed that. This one barely clears still. So it's like, it seems strong, like I've tugged on it, like decent amount of force for what it should take in its lifetime. So I think that's good. If it breaks, it breaks. I don't know what to do at that point. JB Weld? Probably. Okay, so the radiator is on. I need to get hose clamps tomorrow. However, my next issue is the oil cooler fittings because this one is right up against the exhaust so i don't i'm coming up with solutions um i want to get vibrant braided hoses however summit doesn't have one with a 90 in stock until like june which is not gonna work for me um so i'm thinking i need to find a 90 somewhere so i get the 90 and then there's a chance i'm gonna have to raise this side up a little more that way it can clear because it's just like it's too low right now if i raise it up like half an inch or an inch it'd be totally fine but that is currently where i'm at and it's really not fun i'll figure it out easy peasy so look at that bad boy damn boy she's thick i tried to get this thing completed today but you know obviously there's some issues such as these not fitting um the oem radiator has a different kind of hose metal hose that has one that sticks off this way and a port that sticks down this way. And the port that goes down this way goes into your reservoir and this connects to here. However, that aftermarket radiator did not have a cap on it. See, there's nothing here. This one does. So now I have to get a T hose or a T and a hose and then combine those two and then that'll go in. But. That's gonna be the video. I hope you all enjoy your night, so. This clip is really late compared to the rest of the video. Uh, I just got vibrant hoses in for the radiator. Uh, I got one that is two feet and one that is one foot. Um, the only other thing that I gotta find out is how to adjust this because the exhaust is in the way. So I'm gonna figure that out 
uh, I'm going to end this video off here. This is probably going to take a while. Let's start in the next one. I got plenty of other stuff to do. Uh, I'll bring you over here real quick. I got a lot of exhaust stuff coming up next. Uh, right here, got Torque Solutions, thermal blankets. This is for the external wastegate. Excuse me, I was burping. Um, here is my cheap downpipe. And I had a local guy here, uh, 10 by 20 uh, performance or fabrication. Uh, he did this, put the cat in there to make it legal. And then we got the tile or people say it differently. T tile, teal, whatever you want to say. Got this here. Got to get that set up for the tuner. So going to end the video off. Hope you have a good one. Peace.